Okay, now we'll see how to fix this uh, opacity problem of this top bar or header. Okay, so like if you scroll down, the header should have a background color, but it doesn't have, okay? So we want to put a bar, a header, a background header, and based on scrolling, the opacity should change. Okay, let's go ahead and do it. And now, in our app, we have already done the basic work of this. So this is our home page. Okay, over here, we have declared this scroll controller because we want to change the opacity of this bar. So that's why actually we have already declared it. And we also have this, uh, uh, but using this actually, we can control the scrolling. So the first thing, because we want to do the scrolling, okay? And later on with opacity, we will use it together. And of course we have the scroll position and opacity and in the init method we have this add listener this one okay it's called scroll listener we pass a listener to it and what does it do it listens to the scrolling and scrolling position okay it listens to the scrolling and scrolling position so as you scroll through it up and down so it gets the position in pixel values and save it to this variable which is called scroll position okay and that's what this listener does and this listener is being called from init state and so do remember that every controller scroll controller every scroll controller has a listener okay so you can pass a listener to it and do whatever you like and because we want to update the state or the scroll position immediately and store it in a variable so we put it in a state set state function because we want to we want this value to be available immediately and uh, help us with the rendering immediately. That's the reason we put it in set state. All right, and later on, of course, we have this uh, value, which is opacity over here. So at the beginning, as we saw, the opacity is zero, right? But now, as soon as you start to scroll, this opacity is not zero. Why not? Because this condition is true. Because when you start to scroll, what will happen that this becomes greater than this one okay well even if you don't scroll it's still greater than this one but what happens when you start to scroll when you start to scroll it is still greater than this one and then we fall back to this condition okay and this condition has a value between 0 and 1 like that okay somewhere between 0 and 1 so we get certain position as opacity like say for example 0 0.4 so if you get 0 0.4 our top bar this bar header section would be a bit transparent but not completely but when it's zero then it's completely transparent that means we can see the background behind this top bar right okay well now in certain position when you keep scrolling skip scroll down and down and down like this in that case this scroll position becomes bigger than the screen height because do remember screen height is fixed like this okay but when you scroll more the scroll position total pixel value has gone up and down or gone up is bigger than bigger than this so this would be the total pixel which is greater than this in that case we'll have complete transparency uh, sorry completely opaque or in this case the background would not be visible behind this okay now you might ask well we already have this thing right and we are passing to our function which is called top bar widget but in your case it could be any function anywhere you want to want just pass this value and the place later on where you want to use it uh, use that one in the color together because you will have a certain color and color should have opacity because if you want to deal with opacity and pass it there in our case we are passing it to a control a container and container has a color okay it could be anything for you but in our case we have used container and so there is a container over here so this container is uh, like say the width is pretty much the width of this whole screen over here and the height should be like around say 70 so these are container right we are passing it to it but now let's hit R and we'll see that it doesn't work. I mean, it's, it's still transparent, right? As we are scrolling up and down, it's still transparent. It's not working. Why not? Because over here, child, single child scroll view. Do remember that it takes a controller. What controller? It takes a scroll controller. So we need to pass the scroll controller to it. So once you pass the scroll controller to it, the scrolling position takes effect so at that moment we can get the value in pixels and once you get the value in pixels 
this position is not zero anymore otherwise it would be always zero if you don't pass this value so if it's always zero of course it's always a transfer in the background right so now because we already passed it the scroll controller so we can get the position the opacity is not zero anymore so we should be able to see that there is a bit of background or background color okay so let's hit r and see the result okay all right now scroll down yes we are getting color as you see now the background is not transparent anymore it is white color okay so let's let's get a bigger look greater look all right okay so now this is after applying opacity okay hopefully you learned something